Actually, our art is a form of storytelling, and we tell stories through our art, and that's another thing that inspires me to continue with my work. Because through my work, I think I'm telling my story of my journey in life. Um, art has been a major impact for me because I had, after graduating high school, I had struggled, uh, got in with the wrong crowd, and started drinking, smoking pot, and it became a way of life for me. Um, I ended up being homeless for 13 years, about that, and continued to drink. I was in and out of jail for petty stuff, you know, sleeping in the bathroom in a public restaurant or something like that, and one day my dad passed away from drinking, and that kind of helped me open my eyes a little bit and I got back into my artwork. My dad had always tried to encourage me to get get into the artwork because he was an artist himself, but um, he ended up passing away and that's kind of what woke me up. culture and I feel like I'm passing part, a part of my culture on to other people and exposing them to our world, the Tlingit people, and trying to keep our traditions and our way of life alive by practicing the art. Uh, people see me do this and you know, just being an example for others to follow is the best way I can teach others to, you know, if they want to sober up or, um, you know, choose a different path in their life or doing artwork, you know. Um, the old uh, saying is that if uh, find something that you love to do, and you'll never have to work a day in your life.